in vedic mathematics so some sutras or topics even you cover in geometry so let us have one simple technique using this vedic maths from coordinate geometry for example if you notice the one question problem in this way find the equation of straight line passing through the points 7 comma 5 and 2 comma minus 8 we already done these type of problems in school level generally we can use in the method so like the given points if it is x1 y1 and x2 and y2 so traditional method you are following both the methods i'll tell you first when you start the using the formula it is like this y minus y1 is equals to y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 in the bracket again x minus x1 so this is actually the traditional method formula okay by using this let us solve the first this problem then i'll explain the simple method y minus y1 this is the first point second point first point x value is 7 y coordinate value is 5 that means x1 y1 and x2 y2 y minus y1 y1 is 5 is equals to y2 minus y1 so minus 8 minus y1 is 5 this minus is formula minus and x2 is 2 x1 is 7 in the bracket again x minus x1 so it's coming lengthy like this so you have to simplify again when you come to this y minus 5 minus 8 minus 5 so minus 13 by 2 minus 7 is minus 5 again x minus 7 so when you cancel this both take 5 LHS and simplify 5 into y minus 5 13 into x minus 7 right so 5y minus 25 if you expand this and 13x minus 13 into 7 so again it's 91 it's 2 minus 7 so minus minus cancel again if you simplify you will take more so x terms take all the terms other side 13x minus 5y minus 91 minus okay plus 25 is equal to 0 this two take right side then 13x minus 5y and it is uh, minus 91 plus 25 so minus 66 take right side plus 66 okay. this is the thing 13x minus 5y is equal to 66 this is the equation of the straight line we have to use this formula it's very lengthy right now same method or same question in Vedic maths how to simplify okay just by seeing the question not taking lengthy because in computer exams when you require to verify or solve you need to use this technique let us take the points 7 comma 5 and um, second point is 2 comma minus 8 so x value and y value so we need x minus y is equals to and x coefficient y coefficient and constant just write minus symbol in between first x coefficient please just uh, take the y coordinates difference this 5 minus this 5 value minus 8 5 minus minus 8 so 5 minus to minus plus 5 plus 8 is 13 the 13 should be here so x coefficient is this y coordinates difference right because first number minus second number y value again when you come to this y coefficient so this minus this 7 minus 2 7 minus 2 is 5 so it should be 5 here LHS is clear now 13 x minus 5 y LHS part is over now to uh, to find the RHS we have two methods but in that short while I'll show you actually the points are like this 7 comma 5 and 2 comma minus 8 to explain I'm writing again here is only the difference middle number difference minus end number difference middle numbers middle number is 5 into 2 the last numbers is 7 into minus 8 these two you can calculate difference you can take so 5 into 2 is 10 minus 7 into minus 8 56 minus 56 so 10 plus 56 66 this exactly will be here so the 66 value is here 
there's no difference. LHS only one step, RH also only one step. By just to observe middle number minus ending number. So product of the means minus product of the extremes. So we know that rule now. That we can apply, you will get this answer directly. So just I wrote step by step, but it's not lengthy. By only observing the points only, we can make these two steps. LHS difference of y coordinate difference here, x coordinate difference here. And RHS middle number minus product of the middle numbers minus product of the last numbers. So this one. So you can take any examples and you can solve. So this is one of the sutra in Vedic maths we can follow to do this coordinate geometry. So